So that's what this video is about. This one sign is when all of a sudden you feel... souls welcome back to my channel my name is michelle we talk about things life love spirituality love attraction and all of that juicy goodness i am an intuitive reader a manifesting coach a reiki practitioner and a life path guide and mentor here to help you along your awakening journey so that you can co-create the life of your dreams and in this video we are going to talk about one sign that you know a manifestation is super super close and this one sign is so so powerful because you're becoming a better person. The whole purpose of life is to grow and to evolve and to ascend and to help our planet be better, right? And whatever's happening on the macro is happening on the micro. So we are all individually a part of it. So when you do your healing, you're helping others heal. I actually created a deck of cards in memory of my daughter that passed away in 2012, which was the start of my awakening journey, a little layer, a little first little you know, eyes open, but not fully open yet. And, you know, the loss of her inspired me to create a deck of cards so that I could communicate with her. Because when she has words and things that she can give to me, I then can know what she's thinking and what she wants me to know and what I can do better in my life. So I created a deck and one of the channeled messages was heal yourself and you help others heal. So that's what this video is about. This one sign is when all of a sudden, you feel such an immense change in yourself. You feel like you have a little bit more compassion for people. You're waking up going like, wow, I'm forgiving so easily. And I don't know how I got here. How did I get here? And it's this profound moment that happens one day where you wake up and you just find that your heart chakra is open and you're seeing things more clearly. It doesn't mean there's not still pain and suffering there, but it's almost like a, oh, now I know my capacity to forgive. Now I know this is possible. And I have this inside of me where before I was so calloused over, there was no way I was forgiving this person. But you know, manifestation is coming when all of a sudden you feel your heart kind of slowly softening and opening up and letting people in. And, and maybe it's because you're being more gentle with yourself. Maybe your self-care routines are really amazing or maybe somebody that always triggers you is not triggering you anymore. And you realize that person is not changing. They're still doing the same things, but you're now just like, wow, I am not bothered by it anymore. And this can happen organically. This can happen with you putting in the work to work on your inner child, to work with a mentor, to work with a Reiki healer or a nervous system practitioner. When you are doing breath work or somatic releases, this 100% will accelerate that process. But if you're newly on the journey and you haven't really invested in yourself yet, which you will, because that's part of the learning process, we have to do that at some point. If you're not really there yet, this can happen organically. And this is how you know the universe is moving you along your journey. You're not in control. We have to surrender and say, universe, <laughs> I know I'm not in control of this manifestation arriving or my life changing or me leaving this job or getting this partner, I'm not in control. My only job is to allow myself to be moved and to keep track of what's happening to me when it's happening to me. This is why journaling is a must because if you're not really sure when you're changing or how you're changing, you're not gonna be able to understand this growth process. And growth is, I should say, the end result of growth is manifestation. When you grow, you receive. Okay. I have a client who she started a YouTube channel and she posted a couple videos. And then she was like, you know what? I'm going to take my growth into my own hands. I've been feeling the call. I've been scared to do it. Michelle, I want to book your mentorship. The first week we worked together, one of her videos kind of went mini viral. So, and it was like viral for her level for where she's at. Right. It's reaching more people is what was really happening for her. Her goal is she just wants to help so many people. And the minute the universe saw her, took the leap, booked the mentorship, she did one call with me. And then that week is when one of her videos got a lot of traction. So this is feedback, right? This is a manifestation coming in for her when she started her growth journey, she started to elevate. She agreed to work with somebody to help her see more of herself. So the sign is all about growth and, and you seeing that you're different. 
you're more compassionate. And what I work on with my clients a lot of times, which sparks manifestations arriving, is when they start to do the healing with their parents, they start to do the healing with their past traumas and they don't attach to it and they separate from it. They allow the body to release when it's meant to release. A lot of times they cry on the call with me and that's all they needed to do. You guys, a 20 minute emotional release can actually really dissolve a trauma. And we might have to do it in layers, but every time you do a release like that, you are letting go of something that has been keeping you in suffering. You are letting go of something that has been keeping you in a mental prison for years. So manifestation is so cool because it's actually an avenue to set you free. You know, you're all here watching these videos about signs and synchronicities. And what you really don't know is that your soul has you here <laughs> without you knowing because you're really absorbing these lessons and not so much the sign. You're here to learn. Yes, signs are cool and we want to know when the manifestation is coming. But what's better is when that manifestation comes, like for my client, when that one video started to get some traction, her manifestation is reaching more people, not having numbers on social media. It's the people that are watching it, right? So for her to see that traction after she chose herself and chose to start working with herself and nurturing herself and having a coach nurture her, that's how it all works. And that's why the manifestation dropped in because she did the work to be more compassionate, to be more forgiving to herself. When you take money from your purse or from your wallet or your bank account and you give it to somebody else and you say, I want to better myself. I am taking money here and giving it to you because I trust you and I know that you're the person that will help me see more of me. You're the person that's going to help me fall in love with myself and my life. And when we're being good people and we are doing this, that's when the manifestations drop in. Think about this. This couch over here was probably worth about $2,000, but I manifested it and got it for like, I think seven or $800. <laughs> cool story. I'll tell you another time. But if you think about it, we are willing to spend a thousand to $2,000 on a couch, but a lot of us won't take $2,000 and put it into us and put it into us becoming the version of ourselves that can leave a mark on the world and can be happier and not be stuck in patterns and addictions and toxic relationships. Don't you think you're worth more than a couch? Think about that. You are worth more than that. So take $2,000, take $4,000, take $800, take whatever you have and put it into you and know that when you are manifesting, you have to invest in yourself. You have to be the one to create the change first to see the thing drop in, just like my client did, right? She was posting those videos and nothing was getting traction. As soon as she said yes, she invested in herself and she committed really to herself, not to me. I was you know, just showing up doing what I'm meant to be doing, but she was the one that has to take the lessons from me and apply them, and she did. And then we get the manifestation because we're becoming that person that is seeing more of who we are and what we came here to do. And when the universe is like a helicopter and it's flying around us and it's watching us throughout the day, and when it sees you working on yourself, it's going to deliver. It's going to drop those little packages <laughs> and you're going to start to receive everything that you want because you realize that, oh, I have to take the inspired action to better myself on this planet, in this body, to detach from my trauma, heal it, release it, but no longer attach to it. It is not who I am. And I shared in another video, I'll link it here, about how I released my trauma with my grief with my daughter, my sexual trauma, physical trauma growing up. You know, there's some days where I didn't want to be in my body and I wasn't in my body and I hated my body because of what my body represented. And we have to detach from that story and say, I love this body. Look at what this body has given me. It helps me walk. It helps me go see sunrises, sunsets. It helps me breathe. It helps me create content. Why would I hate this? And it's so unconscious in us. We hate it because it holds the pain. It's a memory. So every time we look at our body and certain body parts, we're triggering unconscious memories. So then we go in numb and we do all this self-destructive behavior and we're not even aware of it. And that's why working with healers and coaches is great because we help you see this. 
and then you no longer are in illness, disease, addictions, injuries, hurting yourself from overworking out or not working out, because that's a form of punishment too, is not allowing yourself to work out and to feel good. So this video is super, super powerful because you are in charge of your manifestations. You can activate them to come in quicker when you choose you. All of my links are below. If you want to start choosing yourself, if you want to start seeing manifestation showing up, do the work on you. And if you need support, I have so many options available on my site. I have another coaching program that's launching on October 1st. I'm in one right now with seven wonderful women and we are growing and evolving and accelerating so quickly. <laughs> And then I have my mentorship, which is eight weeks. I have one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you just need a breakthrough call, everything is below. I'm sending you so much love. And don't forget when you're seeing the sign, when you wake up one day and you realize you're different, you're growing, you're more compassionate, you're more forgiving, you're not triggered as much. This is when you are so, so close to receiving some sort of drop-in just like my client did, right? It's a baby step on the way and we keep going, we don't stop there. All right, lovies, thank you so much for supporting me and my channel. I'm sending you so much love, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, and I will see you in the next one. All right, peace out.